what I've learned is that, again, you hear me talk about systems all the time. And the five things that I'm going to be going over in today's episode about how to launch a new business builder is going to be a game changer. So sit back and enjoy. Welcome to the Network Marketing Made Simple podcast. I am Scott Aaron, and each and every week, I am going to come to you with simple, short, and powerful tactics and tips on what you can do each day, each week, each month, and each year to grow your network marketing business, income, and team. And just remember, network marketing is not easy but it can be made easy with simple steps to bring you the success that you truly deserve. Welcome to episode 51 of the Network Marketing Made Simple podcast. So if you are a new listener, welcome. And if you are a returning listener, welcome back. And as always, Before I jump into today's content, if you are a network marketer and you are feeling stuck in your business or it's maybe going backwards or it's plateaued or it's not growing the way that you should and you're really only focusing on Facebook and Instagram because that's what was taught to you in the beginning and it's not working the way that it was, then I invite you to go over to www.scotterron.net Click on schedule and book a free call with me so I can learn about you, your business, your struggles, and how I could potentially help you with my LinkedIn Leads Accelerator program. So in today's episode, which I'm super stoked to go over, is the five-step process in launching a new business builder. And this is something that people have been asking me for a while. They, they don't have problems enrolling business builders, but what's, what's a really great simplistic way to duplicate someone jumping into the business with you? So what I've done is I've come up with this simple five-step process that I'm going to go over with you guys today. And if you can follow this five-step process, make it a part of your system. Make it a part of your team's system. You're going to have massive, massive duplication. So number one, when you are launching a new business builder, the first thing that you should do is go over that person's 12-month, 24-month, and 36-month goal. Now, why do you do this? Number one, you want to see what kind of money mindset this person has, but Even more than that, if you have someone that is willing to commit and give you what their three-year goal is in their network marketing opportunity, now you have someone that is looking to do this business as a marathon and not a sprint. If someone, when you ask that question to someone and they can't answer it, well, I, I'm not really sure. I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to be doing this in three years or I don't know. I don't want to, whatever it is. When you have someone that can commit themselves to giving you an answer for their 12, 24, and 36 month goal, that is someone that's going to run with you. So, number one, find out their financial goal. Number two, Help them define their business avatar by having them list their top five attributes that they seek to attract in teammates on their own team. And this is really important because you guys have heard me talk about this before, about the importance of your business avatar, the importance of not looking for just anyone, looking for yourself, not looking for the many looking for the few, and not looking for the quantity, looking for the quality. This is key. And what I can share with you is this. Again, I've gone through this exercise with you guys before. Typically, when you ask this question to someone and they reveal to you what their top five attributes they're looking for in someone else, 
It's typically how they view themselves. So again, you want to start with their financial goals and then second, move into the personal attributes that they want someone to have on their team. Number three, have them listen to episode 49 of my podcast. And I released it a little while ago. And it goes over the 10 for one posting system on Facebook in the very, very beginning of someone's network marketing journey. I always suggest getting their feet wet by getting onto Facebook and Instagram to just to get the understanding of how social media works, tap into some people, the low hanging fruit that are ready to join. But the way that the 1041 was taught about five to seven years ago is different than the way that it needs to be taught now. So if you go back to episode 49 of the Network Marketing Made Simple podcast, just copy the link and send that to them to listen to. It's going to paint them a very, very clear picture of how to start their network marketing business on Facebook and Instagram. So number one is their financial goals. Number two, their top five attributes. Number three is the new 1041 posting system for Facebook and Instagram. Now, number four, have them buy my book. Have them go onto Amazon and buy the LinkedIn book for network marketing. Now, why is this so important? Steps three and steps four having them understand the 1041 posting system on social media for Facebook and some of Instagram and learning how to attract product users but having them read my book which teaches them the business side of network marketing you got a recipe for success right there so number 3 obviously is the 1041 number 4 have them go buy my book on Amazon it's $14 on Amazon paperback $3.99 for Kindle, and if they have Kindle Unlimited, it's free. And finally, number five, get them to an event and have them repeat this process with every single person they enroll. The events are key because they reinforce the vision of what is possible in network marketing. But their goal is to get that vision and then to recast it through this five-step process to every single person that they enroll. This is easy, this is duplicatable, and this will create massive, massive results for you and your business. So number one, go over their 12, 24, and 36-month financial goals. Number two, have them write down their top five attributes that they are seeking to attract in the type of teammates they want to grow their business with. Number three, have them listen to episode 49 of my podcast that goes over the 10 for one posting system. Number four, have them download, order, and read my book, the LinkedIn book for network marketing. And number five, get them to a team event or a company event and have them repeat this process with every single person that they bring in. So guys, I hope you found this content helpful. Please enjoy the rest of your days, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye, everybody. Have you ever thought about starting your own podcast? When I was trying to get my podcast, Success Made Simple, off the ground, I had so many questions. How do I record an episode? Where do I find background music? How do I get my show on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, and all the other places that people like to listen? Where do I find advertisers? The answer to every one of these questions is really simple. Anchor. Anchor is a one-stop shop for recording, hosting, distributing, and monetizing your podcast. And best of all, it's 100% free and 100% ridiculously easy to use. For me, I wanted to do something quick and simple. And if I have a thought in my mind, I can do a mini cast that's 8 to 10 minutes or even invite a guest on to do one with me. So if you've always wanted to start a podcast, go to anchor.fm slash start to join me and the diverse community of podcasters already using Anchor. That's anchor.fm slash start, and I can't wait to hear your podcast.
So again, thank you so much for checking out today's episode. And if you can go over to Apple Podcasts or iTunes and leave me a five-star rating, write a review, and share this with anyone that you feel could benefit from this, I would be so, so grateful. And again, if you would like to learn more about LinkedIn and how I can personally assist you in growing your network marketing business, head over to www.scotterron.net and schedule a free 15-minute coaching session with me today. Have a great day, and I'll see you guys next time.